Hi guys, now we're Tim Wolf here. Today I'm going to do a video for you on how to roll back firmware on your Western Digital Live Plus boxes. The reason you might want to roll back your firmware on one of these boxes is so you can watch the US Netflix in Canada or another country. With the current firmware you can't do so. It has an IP tracer on it so it just does not allow you to do it. Okay, to get started guys, just check in the description for a link to this website. It will give you the firmware that you need in order to uh, roll back. So all you have to do here is just cursor over the purple highlighted stuff. It will give you serial numbers of Western Digital Boxes which you can find in the About on the Western Digital Live which I'll show you later. Check to find out which one you need to download by just corresponding with the two. I have a North American one so I'm going to use the North American firmware. I'm just going to click Save As here and pick a location on my computer where I'll easily be able to find it. I have a Western Digital folder set up and I'm going to just stick it in there. Just click Save to download it. Now I'm not going to actually download it because I already have it downloaded, but it takes a couple minutes. If it does delay on you and it's taken forever, just cancel and try doing it again. I had a little bit of trouble downloading it and it took me about three times and then it downloaded really quickly. You can use this website to do this. Uh, it's pretty straightforward and it really explains it well. But if you like, you can just watch the video and I'll walk you through it as well. Okay, now locate the folder where you put the files. Right click on this file and go to Extract All. Find where you want to put the files and then just hit Extract. This, is, this will extract the files into a folder. Open up the folder to make sure you have the three files in this folder. So that we have these files, guys. You want to drag them down into your USB stick. Mine's a cruiser, so I'll just drag it into there. The files will copy easily into the stick. Now just open the stick to make sure that the files are in the stick. You want to make sure that they're just on the outside, that they're not actually in a folder in the stick, or it won't be able to read it on your Western Digital Drive. So now we can take our USB stick out of our computer and bring it over to our Western Digital Drive. There's two USB ports on your Western Digital Drive. You can stick it in either or, either or will work. Here I'm just going to quickly show you how to find out your firmware version. If you just go to your system settings and then go right to the very bottom is about In this about, if you look at the top, it shows your firmware current version. 1.06.42 is the current one. The part number below it is that number that on the website shows you which version you should download. So now you can just hit the back button, take you back into the system settings. So go to settings and then go to new firmware found. Now you'd like to hit OK. It will say 2.06.16. That's just because it only wants to download a newer version. This will revert back to 1.16. So just click OK. Now this is going to take a little bit, guys, to reboot the system and to download the new files and stuff. It's very straightforward and it walks you through it. So I'm just going to skip ahead and I'll meet you in a couple minutes. So after everything's done, your system will reboot, download all the firmware, and install it. Now, it will say that new firmware is found. You don't want to upgrade again or that'll put you back to the current firmware again. You can go back down to the About screen in your system settings and it will show you if the firmware did download correctly. click on about and now we should be at 1.06.16 and everything is good. Uh, the one thing I do recommend after you have verified this um, it is best to unplug 
the Western Digital Drive for a couple minutes and then plug it in. It will just sync everything in and it seems to work the best. Alright, good luck guys.